All right, guys, so we're still here at Idea. The music quieted down. They might be able to hear us this time. Wow. This will be much better. So uh, we've been covering all the resorts and some details on some resorts so you have some better information so that when you do your travels, um, you can go to an inform to where you're heading to. Um, Remember, there's always there are links on the websites to get you to their websites. You can look at their stuff. So before you travel, you want to make sure you're going to a place that fits your personality. So Suzelle's here with me, who's been to every one of these places, and uh, we covered all the super clubs. We've got a couple others that uh, she's going to cover for you to give you the details on those. So what's what's left? What are we going with here? Well, we have um, another company called Fit to Travel that organizes travel the same way Fit Buddies does to some other properties. We work with a couple swept away. That's in the grill. We send yoga Pilates positions and group fitness position, there are spin bikes in this property. So we'd like to have the pros be able to do that, but, but it isn't uh, something that we make a restriction on. But we would love to see that most of the, the people signing up that we can do that. Um, that is an adult resort. Uh, couples usually there, but it doesn't have to be couples. Even though it's called couples, that doesn't mean it's couples. That means it's who owns it, couples, resorts. Um, so that can be two friends, two male friends, two female be. friends? It can That's okay. okay. Typically you're going to see couples there, so it might be that it wouldn't be your choice if you were going to come with your friend, but it's okay if you do. We don't have any complaints. Okay. Um, then couples also, we have two others in Ocho Rios. Couples San Susi. used to be Grand Lido San Susi. And it is a five-star resort, and it is an adult resort, and it is couples typically, but yeah, you can bring um, somebody with you, uh, or go as a single if you want. Uh, one position there, we have a group fitness position. And there's a local membership with those two properties, which is real interesting, because local right. Jamaicans come to take classes, so you will have a regular group similar yeah, to what classes, you have These classes don't get canceled. No, they don't and get And they come canceled. lively, right. they, they, and so they're gonna and expect they the full expect, class. Right. They expect good stuff, that's why right. we uh, make the restrictions on people that we uh, activate. Right. Um, the next property is closed right now on renovations. I'm talking about a $20 million renovation going on. And it used to be called Couples of Trios. They are changing the name to Couples Tower Isle when it reopens. Uh, new gym. I can't I can't wait to see it. I've seen drawings. We said yoga Pilates, a group fitness there. We just put in spin bikes there. So when it reopens in January, keep that in mind. It's a wonderful property. They get more than one position there? Or yes, is? I have yoga Pilates and group fitness oh, there. Yeah. Both. yeah, and San Susi, I keep forgetting this, I have tennis positions there, tennis and group fitness, so. Um, Where are all your tennis spots at, real quick? Tennis, real if quick. You've missed, if you've missed them, I haven't got to some, but yeah. Uh, oh gosh, no, let's see. Squash Rose, you know, Rose Hall, which we haven't gotten to yet. Um, couples, San Susi, and Point Village, which we haven't gotten to yet. Oh, and Breeze's Good Fun, which we haven't gotten to yet. So we haven't missed it at all. No, we haven't Disregard really. all that. Go ahead, you'll get to it. I sort of did. This is okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, then, now we have Rose Hall, which used to be the Wyndham, and you may still call it the Wyndham, but it's no longer the Wyndham, it's owned by luxury hotels. It's called Rose Hall Resort and Spa, and soon to be something else, but it's still the Rose Hall property. It is a family resort. We said group fitness instructor and a tennis pro. Um, it's a great property near Montego Bay in the Rose Hall area. We also have the Ritz Carlton in Rose Hall. Ritz Carlton, which is again near Montego Bay, two positions at Ritz Carlton. There is a yoga position and there is a group fitness position. One thing in, to keep in mind for the for the uh, Ritz Carlton, it's not an all-inclusive resort, but we're working really hard to make it as all-inclusive as it possibly can by um, by having a food allowance. And, um, and you've done a lot of negotiating. Yes. I mean, I've been through enough of this since this property came online yeah. that you've been back and forth. So yeah, we've worked really hard. There's a particular clientele there, and, and it is something that you really shouldn't miss. Should give it a try, even though it's a little scary because it's not all inclusive. But the instructors that have been there have found that it's really not hard to keep everything in within that $150 a day. And we're working on the concierge floor, which gives you some snacks throughout the day and some uh, free bar. Uh, oh, so there are ways to get a few perks out of that. Yeah, okay. and so okay. we're kind of getting ourselves in on that too. Okay. So it's it's something that you should, uh, if you have any any ideas that you want to try out, one of the top properties in the world. Uh, not that the other places aren't great, right. but this property is pretty. It smooth. does stand out a bit, right? Um, then we have couples swept away. Couples swept away is in the grill. I already said that. Oops. Yeah. What else is there? Oh, Point, Point Village. Point. Yeah, I talked about that. Then Point Village. We'll go back and we'll figure out which ones we forgot. Point we'll Village create a in new the grill. Someday later. <laughs> Point Village in the grill. 
And it is a it is cool, cool property. I it's nestled between Grand Lane and Negril and you visit too. Yeah, and, and, and it's so close and he hasn't even been there. I know. I've but, been uh, to Negril huh? six times now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Something I know. like that. And it's so funny because it's kinda hidden. In it's November at, at the Fifth point. Beach. Uh, right, I, I know. get that in my camp. We could probably go over just some yoga because they have right. the coolest spot for yoga there. It's called Point Village because it's on the point. Right as you're coming around Bloody Bay, if you've never been to Negril, you know what I'm talking about. And at the very point, you can see the sunset very clearly. At some of these other resorts, you've got to kind of crick your neck to see it. <laughs> well, there's this natural pool. It was made by the water coming in and going out. And this is all rock formation, and that's where we do yoga at sunset. And or whatever else we teach them. <laughs> but it is really cool, and it's so Jamaica. Okay, it's so, so Jamaica. Family adult, resort. Adult family resort. Family resort. Tennis we have there. and group fitness. Both, and we will switch right? out yoga. So you're going to see three pop up if you're a tennis pro and a group fitness instructor. Tennis okay. is all the time. All the group time. Group fitness and yoga is whoever signs up first. Right? Interchangeable on those two. Yeah, okay. yeah. And they like either one and everyone loves going there. It's, it's, a, nothing, it's, it's not a big glamorous lobby. It just has that Jamaican personality. It has a Jamaican true. personality. Very nice. Everybody loves it. Um, okay. And we, okay, so that's Jamaica. We have Mexico still. We, we still there have yet, one so in Mexico. Okay. And a few kind more to come. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, kind of two. Um, El Dorado Seaside Suites in uh, the Cancun area, Playa de Carmen area. It's for yoga only right now, although I have been putting the pitch in. And, um, and there's two hotels side by side, so the yoga instructor comes in, and at 9 o'clock in the morning they teach at the resort next door, which is right next door. It's just a, just a short distance. And at 10 o'clock they teach the, at the place they're staying, and then they're done. 11 o'clock, day's done, ready to party. Um, the property next door is called Hidden, and Hidden is a an all-natural property. Uh, Hidden 100 is a, of the time, right? That, yeah. that doesn't have a fruit site, but that's no. not where they're staying. They're you're staying at the. Staying, yeah. You're staying at the. Okay. But now we have an option soon to come on their website. You might have seen it already. Uh, Hidden, I sent an email about it. We're looking for tantra yoga instructors now. We're right. still working on the details, so that's why you haven't seen it come up because. Um, we don't have the details on exactly how it's going to be done. And management just did a shift. So we have a new manager in it. But we are going to do it, which means we'll have a second position available for yoga instructors. And we're going to probably do some sort of a yoga, a tantra yoga introduction. Like we were going to some talk kind of an introduction to it so we can get them. Okay, yeah, because yeah. we can put that together. Yeah. So, so we'll make those available to you. So you yoga instructors who maybe know about it but have never dealt with that, then the tantra side will have some information for you. So. And this is an adult-only resort, uh, no children at this one. Oh uh, gosh, have we covered them? I think we did it. Okay. Yeah. I'm so late, you can I'm tell we don't have notes. Session, so. <laughs> no, He's but we're gonna we're gonna have a, we're gonna have a bunch of these things, and I am late for my I'm session. I'm almost late for my session. So we're at the Idea Convention in Las Vegas, and uh, you can hear music in the background. And we have finally managed to get this together. Got the camera going, and we haven't done interviews like we said we're going to, but we've had a lot of fun at the booth, met a lot of different people. Yeah. Um, Made a lot of connections. First out of Tony since Tony did do a video Tony. just for you. Hey, so. Tony, how are you? Tony's our Brazil guy. He went to Brazil <laughs> yeah. for us, and he's going to get us back in there. So. All right, so there's your information on. We'll do some more, maybe back at the hotel or outside on the strip. Uh, we'll get a couple more of these up and have a bundle of information you guys can enjoy watching. <laughs> That'd be great. All right, bye-bye.